How are y'all doing today? Coming to you with another time of prayer for this prayer focus. As always, this is a time where you can separate, separate a part of your day, section out something for God, where you can seek the face of God, where you can press into the Lord, where you can receive whatever it is in this prayer time you need to receive. Come into God's presence and go to God in thanksgiving and expectation of a good father, okay? In this time, I'm just a brother in Christ, connected with you in prayer, by faith, and by the Holy Spirit himself. So in this time, I ask also that there be no distractions around you for your time with God and that you seek the Lord yourself, that you press into God yourself. He wants to hear from you. He really does. He really does. So with no more further ado, without being said, let us just spend some time with God, okay? Oh, Lord, we thank you, man. We praise you for what you're doing. We praise you for all you're doing, Lord. You are powerful, Lord. Great are you. Lord, I come before you in Jesus' name, and I see the whole congregation. Hallelujah. I'm looking at the whole con congregation of people who are praying right now, lifted up in different colored robes. They are lifted up to you, God. In Jesus' name, we ask that you have us, Father. You have us in the name of Jesus. By the power of God, we pray that you move in us, Lord. Come into the depths, into the nook and crannies of our heart. Come into the spaces where we don't want anyone else to know about. Father God, we ask that you liberate us from all types of dominions. We ask that you de defeat every single fornication and evil spirit in Jesus' name. By the power of God, I proclaim deliverance over all the people listening, over all the evil that is there in their lives. I declare in Jesus' name that God is real, that he is powerful, that he is in his throne. He is king and the great warrior he is. He is a powerful warrior who will defeat and be victorious and defeat every enemy. He will shatter every enemy. He will shatter every diabolical scheme coming against you. I pray in Jesus' name that witchcraft is abolished. I proclaim in Jesus' name that witchcraft is being deleted just like the name is being wiped away. I proclaim in Jesus' name every single attack coming against you is defeated, is abolished and broken in Jesus' name. I proclaim God is the deliverer and the establisher of all things. So anything that is contrary to his establishment has to go. In Jesus' name, God is moving powerfully. He is shaping people. I see the lungs of somebody being shaped now. I see healing happening. I see protection. I see blessings pouring out. I see blessings being bestowed into people right now for his deliverance happening. God is the one who gives transactions and he trades. It's a part of his covenant. When you loosen yourself to him, he presents himself to you. It's a fair trade, but so much greater on his side. Father God, we thank you for what you're doing. We thank you for your presence. We thank you for your help and we thank you for your, for your orchestration, Lord. The will of God is moving in people. Hallelujah. Jesus, thank you. God, you take care of us, Lord. You move through us, Lord. You shape us, Lord. You define us, God. You name us, Lord. You orchestrate us and you are giving us what we have to receive. Lord, you see us as precious to you. You see us as precious to you, Lord. So we receive that identification. God, we declare in the name of Jesus, you are moving powerfully amidst all our troubles, all the, the things that are coming against us and trying to block us. Lord, we proclaim you are the one breaking and unclogging and unblocking and defeating and moving out the way what needs to be moved out the way. I see God shifting things and obstacles out of people's ways now. Hallelujah, Jesus. Thank you, Father. Thank you, Father. And thank you, Father. Lord, loosen your will. Push through everything that needs to be pushed through. Lord, you have it all, Father God. You have it all. Lord, we declare that you are the one who moves forward ahead of us and behind us and to the left of us and to the right of us. There is nothing that can stand against us with you, Lord. We declare your peace into us. We declare your passion for us, Lord, because it is constant, it is real, and it is never ending. It is for you and to us to have one and intertwinedness. Lord, we thank you for your passion for us. You love us and you cherish us and you see great things in us and you have 
such great plans for us, Lord. We declare your plans in our lives. We declare that you are rewriting things in our lives right now. You are taking your pen and rewriting what needs to be written in Jesus' name because we are following you, the path of you, Lord. You have declared what you have wanted and you have made it so. God, we bless your mighty name. We thank you for this time. Father, we love you and we praise you for everything you're doing. I say amen and the congregation of believers listening say, in Jesus' mighty name, amen and amen. Well, guys, be blessed. I will see you on the next video. Take care.